Shellex YouTube channel. Today my review is on self-adhesive leather. This is the leather that I purchased from Lazada. You can see a piece of leather about 15 cm and behind there's a sticker. So if you remove the sticker, it can glue by itself. So this leather, you can fix it on sofa, on your car leathers and more, mostly it's for to repair the leather's been torn apart. So today I'm going to use this leather for my sofa. As you can see, my sofa has been torn and I'm going to remove this uh, extra torn part first. So just take your scissors and cut it off because you don't want to have to overlapping and then uh, make sure it's all even before you fix the adhesive leather so now after i've removed all the extras i'm going to show you how to fix this is the price that i purchased from lazada for a piece of patch leather so just remove a tiny bit of the sticker so you do not remove everything because then it will lose its grip so once remove little, try to fix it first before you remove fully. So then you place it on and then you flatten it. Make sure all the air is out from the sticker. Then slowly you press it downwards and then remove the entire sticker. So this is about 15 cm I guess. Uh, it's not a very big leather fixer uh, repair patch but it's just a small patch. Okay, so just remove it all and then flatten it and then you can take your scissors and cut it off if you want or I prefer not because um, I think I need the full one so that it will be more durable, it won't be removed easily so if it's the full one, you'll cover fully the full entire spot which been torn out completely has been stick to the sofa now but i feel something is not right because it doesn't look durable it doesn't look uh, even so i'm going to remove it out it, it's removable so you just remove and you can stick it back but make sure you do it as fast because if you don't do it as fast i i do not think that this, the glue will last long so once you stick it like uh, remove or stick it Make sure you, you, you also flatten it back again properly and squeeze all the sides. If you want, you can also cut it off. If not, uh, depends to your, your choice. So now I've already flattened and stick it well again. So let's see whether it's durable but it's still removing out. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it out and uh, again going to push it into the sofa on the sides. So it will be stick into it. And then now I'm, I'm, I'm going to place it again let's see how it looks like finally I think this is how it should be but can you see it's coming out so if you all want you all can use some glue uh, glue, uh, strong glue but I don't want to damage my sofa because uh, but I think it's better if you use a glue because it will never remove at all so it depends to your choice guys so as you see this leather patch is not so great but it, uh, at least it can cover up all the torn part and make the sofa look better look nicer so that's about it so i have done the patching now i'm going to cover it up with my sofa cloth of course because i don't want it to be seen uh, now as i cover up as you can see this is how it looks like it cannot be seen it's good and uh, once I touch it, it feels comfort and strong back. I will give 6 out of 10 for this leather repair patch. So it depends to you guys that if you want to watch us or not. See you all soon in another video of mine. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. Sayonara.